And look at this. Another chop there. And Jesus Christ. Oh, just... Lani Katana with a super kick. A shot to the face. And now... And there you go. Well, that's the win for Jessica. Jessica Pick. That's the win for Jessica Pick. And now, wait a moment. Just drilled could What the heck? What the fuck was that about? On a day like this as well! That was completely unnecessary! What in God's name came over, Jessica? Well, bottom line, ladies and gentlemen, Jessica Pick has won this matchup. But that attack there! Why in God's name did you do that? Well, anyway, people, the next tribute to Lucario from Team Chaotix and then from Randy Lee.
Okay, people. Our next matchup of the night. Hardcore Rules Tornado Tag Action. And this one, um, this is a little bit interesting in this one, I have to say. Sees the return of the Master Chief to CXWI action. This next Hardcore Rules Tornado Tag Match is set for one fall. It is in first from parts unknown, weighing in at 320 pounds. The Master Chief! Arby and the Chief, they of course... Uh, of course you think about Arby and the Chief, you go back once again to the rivalry between the Horsemen and um, the Order. This will be the first time that Chief and Arbiter have teamed up since they broke up as a tag team following the news back home from San Galios. From the state of Arab San Galios, playing at 329 pounds, he is one half of the CXWI Tag Team Champions, the Arbiter. Also have the one half the tag champions alongside Jack Stanbridge. We heard Jack's tribute earlier. We also heard Arbiter's tribute earlier. I know one thing for certain. Arbiter will want to put on the show, and he mentioned about he mentioned about how hard it can be losing a member of your family. It's a feeling that Arbiter does have very strong feelings about and definitely sympathizes with the brotherhood and what they're going through. Opponents. I'm Hyrule, weighing in at 239 pounds. Link. Here of course is Link and uh, well, couldn't team up with Mario or Luigi, they've already been in action tonight. Link has had to try and find someone else to team up with. So Link will have to probably have to fall through this pretty carefully considering the guy against Arby and the Chief. Oh, he definitely fought through it carefully. He definitely fought this one through. The individual that will take on Bob in a KO only match at the Path of Glory CPV. It's Broly! Broly! Introducing his tag team partner, weighing in at 530 pounds, Broly! This, uh, this is a hell of a choice uh, made by Link, particularly for hardcore tag team rules against a team like Arby and the Chief. Master Chief, we haven't seen him compete since not the previous Golden Ambitions, but the one before that one, in which he lost to the Arbiter. Loser leaves CXWI. The two of them really did bury the hatchet on what was a very personal rivalry. One but centered around the, the Arbiter's family. And now we got ourselves a Hardcore rules tag action, but sees Arby and the Chief reforming again to take on Link and Broly. Now I'll tell you what, people. 
even though Lincoln Broly have never teamed up before, just Broly and himself will be a tough test for Arby and the Chief. Of course, another one of the things that needs to be brought up. Notice that Arbiter is still wearing the bandages around his, uh, his waistline, around his abdomen area. Which, of course, as I mentioned before, he was the victim of a stabbing. But you see, I don't think that's ever been anything to hold Arbiter down. Now chair shot! And Arbiter right now! Drilled! You see now! Pull back and I'll be there with the shot. And a pile driver! Nicely done! Done. See that? Oh! Well, Brody there looked like he was going to try and go to continue the attack on Master Chief, but he was stopped dead in his tracks. And now Arbiter, it's like legs going out there on the attack, and Arbiter there with the power bomb. Remember, on the hardcore rules, fools do count anywhere, so. Belt shot from behind. And Link going to try to cover on Arbiter. Of course, one of the things I do know is that Link and Arbiter are very good friends. Of course, this once again goes back to the early days of Koopism. During a period in which Arbiter was suspended due to his emotional problems, he ended up assisting Link in one of his missions to try and take down Koopism. Of course, it would be a mission that would only do, in many ways, further damage to the Arbiter. But, you know, Link, he was one of the people that honoured Arbiter. You lot remember the Hyrule, Hyrule ceremony that mourned the end of the war against Koopism. Of course, another one of those individuals that was honoured that day was Lucario. I think, ladies and gentlemen, after this... I think, ladies and gentlemen, after this, we've got one more matchup. Our main event. It will be Mewtwo. One on one with Blazer Ken. And also, people, I should say, following that, we do have a... um. An announcement that will be made by um, an announcement that will be made by Shepard. Although we have no clue what the message is about, what the announcement will be. Remember, this one's under hardcore rules, and here comes Broly. There's that power game. Interestingly, Broly is pretty much 300 pounds. Or, sorry, no, 300, 200 pounds heavier than Arbiter. Of course, Arbiter, over the past few days, he's actually been losing quite a bit of weight. We don't know if he has been dieting or it's just been a result of his stab wound. But it's just made him lose a lot more weight. We don't know. Although, to be fair, I think any of those are actually kind of funny. I know Arbiter wouldn't think of them as being funny, but. I think it is. Uh, I do not. Never mind. The bottom line is he's lost weight, so that will keep Richard Simmons happy. See now, nicely done. 